British Ghanaians Lost in Translation is a documentary which highlights the serious issue of language endangerment within the British Ghanaian community. Many second and third generations of Ghanaians living in the UK cannot speak a Ghanaian language fluently. I wouldn't say fluently, I can speak a little bit of Definitely not. I've been trying to learn, but it's kind of hard. But I can understand it, but I can't speak. Not fluently, you can understand and you can try. In essence, this weakens their connection to their cultural heritage and their identity as Ghanaians. This story is not unique to Ghanaians in the diaspora. Language endangerment is taking place in communities all over the world. It is estimated that every two weeks, a culture loses its language to one of the five dominant global languages, English, French, Arabic, Spanish, and Mandarin. By 2050, half of the world's 7,000 languages could be wiped out. And when a language is lost, humanity loses the cultural wealth and the important ancestral knowledge that is embedded within that language. The truth is, if the Ghanaian community don't do anything to preserve the learning of Ghanaian languages within the diaspora, the Ghanaian languages will eventually die out. This pattern will be perpetuated if native Ghanaians coming to the UK continue to prioritise English in their households. This has been prevalent within the British Ghanaian community for decades. We want to encourage the Ghanaian community to learn, share and preserve the richness of our languages, as well as speaking English and other languages. How do native Ghanaians feel about this issue? Well, there's only one way to find out. Otis must go. We're in the early stages of making part two of Lost in Translation and we need your help. We're after just £6,000 to cover production costs. I'll be venturing back to the motherland to find out how are non ghanaian language speakers received? Are there work opportunities available? Are there language learning facilities available to help them settle in and contribute to the Ghanaian economy in the long term? And what is the Ministry of Education doing to encourage native children to learn their own dialect as well as English? There'll be an opportunity to have a producer's credit and to be a part of this exciting initiative to help put an end to language endangerment. So, join this campaign. Otis must go. Hey. Hey, Sam. Yeah, how's it going? Yeah, really right. well, man, really well. Wow. How's it going with the language lessons? Oh, a year, a year, a year, a year. Oh, wow, sounds so good. Did you see I have no country, I can't wait to make a power home. Yeah. <laughs>